AppalachianWireless.com is here to make your life easier. Sign in or create a self-care account to pay bills, view usage, or check contract dates. You can also apply for paperless billing and auto pay to save up to $5 per phone per month on postpaid plans. It's self-care from Appalachian Wireless. On the evening of Wednesday, April 5th, a hillside fire was started near Coal Run on Old Wagner Station Road. First responders from the Coal Run Volunteer Fire Department were quick to arrive and assess the situation with the help of the Kentucky Division of Forestry. At the time of recording, there was no property damage and no injuries. Uh, we received a call of a large forest fire over in this area on uh, near Mossy Bottom or Wagner Station Road. And so we responded with our engine two and a tanker. And uh, we come up here, we checked all the houses and look, try to find exactly where the fire was, if any houses were endangered, and uh, just assess the, the scene. The, the fire is still contained up on the hill. There's no property damage, uh, nobody's been hurt, anything like that. And it's in a, a pretty good area where we don't think it's going to spread anywhere else or anything like that. We have notified forestry, that way they can actually go up and you know, do the job they have to do. And we'll, we'll be down here, we'll protect the houses and make sure nothing is endangered or anything like that. A dead tree falling onto a power line is suspected to be the cause of the fire. Call Run Volunteer Fire Department prioritized protecting residents and their homes while forestry tackled the fire directly. So we did find a, a dead tree that looks like it may have fallen on a power line and uh, that caused an arc probably and uh, could have started the fire. That's what, that's what we found on the other side of the ridge. As soon as forestry does get here, we do believe the fire will be put up, you know, be out pretty quickly. Uh, we are expecting, I believe, some rain tonight, which you know helps with forest fires. There's not a lot we can do down here on the ground except for protect uh, you know, the residents' homes and ensure everybody's safety. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.